Welcome to the first video in a series of videos on the scientific method. This video is going to discuss the observation of a phenomenon. They're about to drop 624 Mentos candies into 104 bottles of Diet Coke and probably get very wet. So it's a kind of a scientific exploration by non-scientific people into how science can be in the everyday. Exactly, exactly. Just having fun. Would it kill me if I tried to drink out of one of these things while I was going off? Pretty cool, right? All around us, awesome things happen. As scientists, we make observations, things we see, hear smell, feel. Observations are facts, not opinions or predictions. Everyone should be able to make the same observation as you. My comment about the reaction being cool is not an observation. It's my opinion. Someone else might not think it's so cool. Let's watch the clip again and make your own observations on your piece of paper. What's happening? They're about to drop 624 Mentos candies into 104 bottles of Diet Coke and probably get very wet. So it's a kind of a scientific exploration by non-scientific people into how science can be in the everyday. Exactly, exactly. Just having fun. Would it kill me if I tried to drink out of one of these things while I was going off? At this point, if you need to, pause the video. Record your observations. What did you see? What did you hear on the video? If you were sitting in that audience, what would you have felt? What would you have heard? Not the screaming of the audience, but about the reaction. These are some of my observations. I saw the soda stream. I saw the bubbles. If I was sitting there and I went and touched those guys' lab coats, I could have told you that based on what I know about soda, it probably would be pretty sticky. I saw that the reaction happened really fast. I heard a fizzing sound. And I saw that as soon as those Mentos hit the Coke, the reaction started. If you have something different than what's listed here, it doesn't mean it's wrong. Everyone looking at the same event might see something slightly different. I look forward to reading what your observations are that I didn't have. Make sure your observations, though, are about what happened. Not that there's Mentos and not that there's Coke, but what happened when it went together. We take our observations and we turn them into questions or a problem statement. I'm sure you had many different questions watching that video. Some of my questions included, why do you always see Diet Coke being used with Mentos? How does it work? Can other sodas work as well? Maybe even better? In science, we want a testable question. The first two questions, I can't really test. I could rephrase the question and come up with a slightly different question and design an experiment. But looking at the question, do other sodas work too, or even better, I know I can design an experiment to test this question. This is the end of this video. Hopefully you know now how to make observations and what an observation is, and how you take these observations and you develop questions that are testable from them. You're now ready to watch the second part and how you take these questions and you make predictions called a hypothesis.